I went up and parked behind the uh, road debris uh, with my arrow stick on. Even had the right arrow stick on telling everybody to move over to the right because I was in the inside lane. Uh, it's crystal clear what needed to happen, uh, but the, the lady that, that struck my unit, she was uh, sleepy, and I guess all the lights in the world wouldn't matter uh, if there's a, an area of inattention. And inattention, that could be a sleepy driving like we're talking about now, it could be cell phone use, any numer of, n numerous uh, electronic devices, it could be anything. I really want the public to know when you see these highway patrol cars out on the side of the road or you see our partners with Department of Transportation, they're literally putting their life on the line uh, for us. And for the highway patrol, we have lost 35 uh, brave men in service to the state of Oklahoma. And about 44% of those men that we've lost have had some kind of connection with a car crash or being struck by a vehicle. We just need people to think about their driving. When you see a vehicle with the emergency lights on and you look at it still getting crashed, um, and then you look at these vehicles that are sitting there fully equipped with emergency equipment and still getting run into, I feel concerned about the, the general motoring, uh, motoring public. We need to educate the people, or the traveling public, and uh, it's an epidemic what we're doing on our cell phones. We need to watch out for our workers and the, the Department of Transportation and OHP, anybody that's got lights and you know, doing a job on the side of the road, we just need to respect their space and just move over.